Last week, Sbarro filed for bankruptcy protection. It's the second time the chain's asked for protection in the last three years. Now, I've probably only been to a Sbarro two times over the last three years, and it was never my first choice. I don't know anyone who actually craves Sbarro, except for maybe Michael Scott. Right here is my favorite New York pizza joint, and I'm gonna go get me a New York slice. For everyone else, Sbarro is the pizza you eat when you're stuck someplace with no other good options, like a mall food court. And Sbarro's bankruptcy filing tells us a little bit about the state of the modern food court. In the filing, Sbarro notes the quote, financial performance has fallen significantly short of expectations due to an unprecedented decline in mall traffic that continues to hamper retailers and restaurant operators. Sbarro is stuck with very expensive leasing agreements at mall food courts. The company's planning on closing around 50 stores. It's already closed 100 Hot Dog on a Stick, another chain frequently found in mall food courts, filed for bankruptcy last month. It cited the same reason, declining mall foot traffic and very expensive leases. With more and more customers shopping online, there is less and less of an opportunity to impulse buy gross pizza while you shop. Sbarro has made some changes to its menu and has emphasized the freshness of its ingredients, but that might not be enough. Consumer tastes have shifted. Now, fast casual restaurants like Chipotle and Panera have made to order items. They have healthier items. Sbarro has pizza that's been sitting under a lamp. Still, the brand does well internationally, and the company's hoping for a speedy turnaround with a quick exit from bankruptcy in May.